Hi there, my name is Jana and I'm a member of the Data Schools 29 cohort at the Information Lab. In this video, I'm going to show you how to send emails using URL actions. This will let you create and send multiple custom emails within your Tableau dashboard. So let's jump right into Tableau and get started. For this example, I'll be using sample superstar data. First of all, I'm going to create simple charts. Let's start with orders by year. Drag order dates to the column and count distinct of order ID to the text shelf. Let's create one more chart. Select a new worksheet, rename it to orders by customer. Put customer name to the rows and unique order count to the columns. Shorten the descent in order and drag gear of order ID to the details. And now, if the sample superstore doesn't contain an email address field, we need to create it by ourselves. From the data menu, click drop down arrow and select create calculated field named email address. Which is our customer name. plus domain at office.com. Click OK and drag it to the details as well. Now we need to add charts to the dashboard. Uh, select the new dashboard icon and drag our charts to the view. I'd like orders by year chart filter out orders by customer. So I select worksheet and press user as a filter button. Now we've got everything to move directly to set up emails, creation and send. So from the toolbar, select dashboard, actions. In the action dialog box, click add action and select go to URL. Rename it to mailing. In the source sheet drop-down list, select the sheet that contains the field with the email address you want to send to. So we've got our email address on the orders by customer. So untick orders by year and choose select and run action on. In the URL box, do the following. Type mail to colon and then click insert menu on the right hand side to select the data field that contains mail addresses. I'd recommend double check your PC settings to make sure that by default mail to protocol is set to use Outlook rather than browser or in other applications. Now, when we specified our email addresses, we might want to enter our subject to our email. To do this, type question mark subject equal sign and then enter the text for the subject line. I'm going to add thank you for choosing us. To add the body of the email, type upper percent body, then equal and now we can use combination of text and uh, dynamic fields to create the email text. So I'd like to make the customer name is dynamic. I type dear, then insert customer name. To add a line break, type percent sign 0A. Then I'd like to inform my customer how many order they did in a specific year. So type you made. Insert dynamic count order IDs 
filled. And dynamic here. Then land break again. Percent zero A. And thank you for shopping with Superstore. Click OK and OK again. Now, if we choose specific year, let's say 2021, and click on one of the customer name, we automatically redirect it to Outlook's new email tab with an email ready to send. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you now feel more confident in using URL action to create and send emails. Please check the description of this video for links to additional materials that you might find useful. If you enjoyed this video, I think you'll absolutely love the related how-to videos we suggested by my fellow data schoolers. Click on the thumbnail on the bottom right to watch it next. Subscribe to this channel to get notified when we release new videos.